Hello everybody, welcome to the Marmos Change Log, version 9.1. This is going to be released in uh, 16th of October in 2023. We are going to see here some features that are um, showing in the interface, so let me show them. I'm here, for example, uh, and one of the things that we have added and small improvement is whenever you want to delete a category, you are going to see this cancel button here um, for UX purposes because the X button up here wasn't that obvious. And that's one. Another thing that we are adding is the red hand sidebar now is resizable, so you can manually decide the size that you want to have in the right hand sidebar and it's going to be storing your user information so uh, that's going to be preserved for uh, if you close this and open it again you're going to see it again another uh, small improvement there is uh, all these emoji recommendations all these reaction recommendations um, are there but if you get the the right hand sidebar very narrow that's going to be reduced to one for ux purposes Another new feature is I'm in this new test channel. I now can uh, invite a group of people. I have this My Users Group group. Uh, if I hit that and hit Enter, you are going to see that that people is now in the channel and I can see them here. Okay. Another another thing is for um, for group messages, now we are changing the default behavior of the notifications. So if you go to the notification preferences, you are going to see that is now the default behavior is now for all activity you are going to receive a message for a group message. Of course, you can disable that only uh, changing that to only for mentions, but that's the new default behavior. And finally, the other thing that we are added is convert to private channel of group messages. Group messages uh, can be modified. You can add people, new people to a, a group message, preserving the, the conversation. So this is a way to preserve the conversation and add more people. So I can convert this group message to a private channel. I'm going to call it uh, my new group uh, channel and I convert that to private channel and now it's a private channel no longer a group message and we can see uh, the whole conversation is preserved and I can add new people to this channel and that's it um, there is uh, another uh, set of changes related to the backend related to system administration stuff or security or bugs all that stuff is in the full chain log that you can see in the release notes but this is the things that are surfacing the interface so thank you everybody